All right, so the consensus is to turn this into a furniture store. <laughs> uh, since we haven't seen that done yet, let's uh, let's do that. It was oh, it was doors. Or um, yeah, okay. Guess that makes sense. Um, I think I want high, to be honest. I think I want just regular. is in place and then I'll go back to this and glass. Now I'm gonna need some imagination from you guys. metal. <laughs> I guess if I want white, it would have to be... I swear there is a plan behind my madness. I went around this backwards, I guess. I should have uh, cleared it out and then come in, but... That's got it. <laughs> I was I don't know what I why I wasn't doing that, but anyway, hi, how are you guys doing? I hope everyone is doing fantastic. Uh, we are gonna go with my original thought before the update was ever applied and do a furniture store. I had originally I that was what I wanted to do, and then I kinda lost interest for one second. Uh, because I was like, I kind of was fascinated with the idea of turning this into a house. But uh, after daydreaming about it, I thought, nope, you know what? We're going to go with the uh, with the furniture store. Especially since you guys were receptive of it. And, and the fact is, is that, again, I already did a museum and I was really proud of it and I just uh, didn't feel like doing it again. 
find Mr. Dinosaur. with these stairs because I don't know. to be able to uh, put walls on the railings in my imagining. fighting so hard to go where I want you to go. quite sure what I'm going to do with that, but that's what we're going with for right now. Okay. to hold my mouse button down to make the breaking box bigger because I keep mixing it up with House Flipper 2. I have played House Flipper 1 for triple the time that I played House Flipper 2. It didn't take very long to get spoiled by those new mechanics. Thing else. 
of these. And then... Okay, so I don't know what I'm going to do with back there. Some kind of employee. This back here I know is going to be uh, the docking bay with furniture coming in and out. That much I know. Like a warehouse, I guess. or the or maybe it's just because I haven't played in a while but it feels like the walls are fighting me where I want to put them Here we go. I have to sell the windows because they're all beat up and yucky and they can't be cleaned. I'm decided what I'm going to do back here. Maybe turn these into offices.
Uh, I've dressed down quite a few tables uh, in House Flipper uh, <laughs> with the forks and the silver and stuff. Someone had to do this one by one. <laughs> it's time consuming. Now there's there's modded stuff that it's all all the pieces are together, which is nice. But um, there is something really nice about individually. I think we're gutted. Um, but now we gotta do something about windows. You know, after I sold that, what? an old one. Got the bar on top. Is it one of these? Oh, I bet it's... Mm, it doesn't quite match up. The Elijah, the closest is, uh, uh, Rada, or however you say it. But we may just completely change it. As far as this doorfront goes. There's a piece of garbage right there. See that? <laughs> that wasn't my imagination, right? There's a piece of food there. Hi. Hey, what? <laughs> See? Right there. What are you doing there? Has chips. I did put it there. Those are chips. What are you doing there, you weirdo? You know, now that I did that, I don't like my color choices.
against the wall or did I have? Spot open. Okay, seriously, my imagination is just the walls that much harder to place. or something. We'll worry about those windows later. I'm gonna have to paint this place too. I'm not looking forward to that. I tell you that much. I did that wrong.
that match? I don't remember. Term memory and all that. Hey, look at me. I'm starting to doubt the fact that I put this doorway so close to here. I'm thinking that's probably going to be an employee break room. Hmm. Undecided though. Absolutely undecided. Happy with the walls. Or the windows, I should say. I gotta go look at some images of some furniture stores. Okay, they're pretty much all the same. White walls. Yeah, pretty much all the same. White walls. Maybe some texture to the walls. decide what to do with the basement. What would I put in the basement? Would it be an employee's only, like, furniture restoration? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't think that far ahead. I guess like, I could also turn it into an employee-only room. Like, that's where the employees drop off their stuff, and that's where their break room is, and then I would turn that into something else. <coughs> I sneezed. I was trying to get that sentence out while a sneeze was building. Uh, I could turn the basement into an employees only section. And then... Uh, 
turn the other room into like a manager's office, maybe. I don't know. Because I know we're going to want a section for living room setup. We're going to want a section for dining room and for a bedroom. Probably some a spot for towels and bathroom stuffs. I want to knock this whole wall down. Knock the whole wall down. You can move this back one. I want to kind of do um, some fake like walls. They're gonna act as dividers. I guess I know what I'm gonna do in the next episode. In between the next episode is actually drop a floor plan. I want to do businesses like this, especially ones that I'm not as familiar with. Uh, I I will legit write on a piece of paper or uh, on a program to figure out the floor plan. <laughs> Uh, I've shown some of that process in other videos as well, where I've uh, made up a floor plan to kind of get an idea. Okay. Ooh, don't break that wall. We work so hard putting it in place. Sort of hate how it ends right there. Oh, but you know what I could do? I could put shelves here, and then one, no one would ever know. Okay, go me, smart me. Bathroom's here, as decided. I'm going to guess employee break room down there. For just a lack of whatever else. guess that takes care of if I do turn this into a bathroom I could turn this into a bathroom display area towels and whatnot I wonder if there's a statistic anywhere or an, a number of how many walls I've painted in playing house flipper. <laughs> and house flipper too, I guess. But in house flipper one, I know it's a lot. <laughs> The 
the other thing I could do, if this is going to be a storeroom, if I put a wall, like, I don't know, here, I would turn this into a display of something. It's not going to be implemented this episode, but I have an idea. difficult. This way. I just trapped myself in here. Go me! Okay, well there is going to be a door in here, so... put a, a bed down but that's not the probably not the bed I'm sticking with but I want to put a bed down just to get spacing idea enough about right here yep. <laughs> okay well it's not gonna be Same idea with over here. How many did I do? One, two, three, four, five. Eleven? Display windows, uh, bedroom, living room, and then I'm maintaining that this is going to be a restroom. This is going to be employees. Uh, docking bay over there for reasons, you know, furniture needs to be unloaded and loaded. And let's think this through. Uh, right. Living room. 
bedroom downstairs, bedroom display area up here. Uh, a whole living center display area here, I think. Um, manager's office, maybe? Another manager's office? Or I open the whole thing up and it'd be no manager's office. How big was downstairs again? It wasn't very big, was it? It was pretty tiny. Yeah, I wasn't very big. Okay. Sticking with my original thought. Gonna have to have a manager's office somewhere. Which would probably be over there, huh? I sort of want to turn it into um, another display area. Like if I knock this wall down. Just realized we have this big here. Office here or no it would be off right okay, so I'm torn in two directions if I make this into an office then in theory the manager or whatever could see how busy the store is then that just could be just plain silly or maybe we don't need a manager's office at all. And the only office in existence is the one that I'm going to make in the front here with, like, the receptionist. No, you would have to have records somewhere, right? Someone has to do the ordering and the calling of the customers when their furniture comes in and whatever, whatever. Nope, you're right. We need an office. We do. We do. Right. Thanks for... Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> But we're gonna we're gonna tear this wall down and I'm gonna turn it into a sales floor. Prime real estate advertising for the front window, right? if I'm going to put a window in there yet. Undecided on that. So the more windows I put in, the less I have to paint.
Maybe now. <laughs> are always so weird on House of Liberty. Actually, they're weird on a lot of games, for being honest. Now, why can't I paint this? Oh. Am I going to have to tile it? There does have to be a section for an office, right? Like actual office furniture, like desks and stuff. I gotta think about that. Always miss some window so fair enough. do something with the office. I'll worry about that another time. We'll put this in here. <laughs> okay, there's got to be a railing there. That's not very safe. <laughs> oh, she's going to have something to say about that. Uh, okay. Bedroom display. Up there. Living room display. Here. A whole bunch of chairs and living room here. Office. Uh, or not office, but uh, an entry desk. Greeting desk, I guess you could say. Um, maybe some displays of bathroom stuff, Nicky Knack stuff here. I guess I should probably paint. Staring right at it. I'm like, does it look so different compared to everything else? Because it needs to be painted.
is gone. Oh, it's so nice to have this kind of lore laying down again. Um, I, I, I'm fine with House Flippers 2 tiling system, but this is still my favorite. And yes, probably because it's less work um, than the other system, but <laughs> still, I do sort of miss it for big rooms. I would, I wish that they let you toggle it between one or the other. Like, it lets you have both uh, of, of, or lets you have the best of the both worlds. Uh, you can have this. Okay, I need to click in place, please. Thank you. different look all together and the fact that I don't have to keep buying buying tiles every five clicks is also very nice there we go very very bright <laughs> i promise i will add some color <laughs> okay i think i'm gonna stop here at least we now have somewhat of a game plan i'm gonna have to go um kind of lay out a floor plan because i know that the rooms that i want is going to be um living room uh dining room office and bedroom with some a section for bathroom knickknacky stuff I also want to display pictures, but I'm not quite sure how I want to do that. If I just want to lay some walls down and use them in, like, faux walls, I'm unsure. I will have to debate that out to myself uh, before I get to the next episode. Oh, look, I missed a section right there. Did I miss? I missed this one, too. Oh, gosh. Alright, I will see you guys in the next episode. Thanks so much for keeping me company.